in search of their first home league win of the season against the Scunthorpe side, one place and one point below them in the table. Throw here of Scunthorpe, Maduro with a touch. Towards Carl Hawley, and now Leon Clark. Oh, it's a fine thumping finish by Clark, and it's a flying start for Scunthorpe in front with just three minutes on the clock. And the on loan Charlton striker Leon Clark makes it three goals in three games since that temporary move to Glanford Park. Can't stop scoring for Scunthorpe. Back here to try and deal with the danger. It's hooked goalwards again and just chested behind by grounds. To be alert here, the defender. And put an ugly corner for Scunthorpe. Decent delivery and the header wasn't that far wide of the target. Running here by Jimmy Ryan. Need to get something on that. Potton puts it towards that far post. It's still not away. Here's Ryan. Quick feet and just couldn't quite find the finish. Took a nick, I think, on the way through. Then from Putty's set pitch that wasn't really dealt with by Oldham. Very bright start to this game from Scunthorpe, though. There is this could be more than one in front. delivers the cross and Carl Hawley couldn't quite connect with the finish. That's a decent opportunity for Hawley here though. And Clark behind him as well. It's Hawley. And Zanis at full stretch. Got fingertips to that. One way traffic at the moment. There's the corner. Keeper comes and doesn't get there. He spilt it, but survived in the end. Did Buzanis, who will be very relieved to see that go over the top. This is Browns, well advanced. Options in the middle. Oh, he's picked out Derbyshire. It's the perfect option for Oldham. They're back on level terms. Matt Derbyshire, their own lone striker, follows Leon Clark's lead at the other end. It's two and two for Derbyshire since his move from Forest to Oldham Athletic. Adding to his debut goal against Notts County on Saturday. With another tonight, back level before the break. And they found a way through here, Hawley. Goalkeeper got something on that and they can't force it in. Scunthorpe so close to restoring their lead before half-time. First Hawley here, denied by Buzanis, and then Clark couldn't quite follow up. There's Montano, trying to look up, delivers the cross. Oh, it's Smith with a header, and Slocum with a save. Just made it his, did Matt Smith, with Derbyshire coming in behind him as well. Zanis. Flick through here for Croft. And still Lee Croft. And then it was taken off him by Derbyshire, who puts the shot straight at Slocum. It's not like there's more goals potentially in this game, though. Just Furman who nips in. Dean Furman. Side netting. Into a power, but not quite the precision in the shot. Searching, remember, for their first home league win of the season. Could they get in here? Not like that. Miscue from Matt Derbyshire. Appealing for offside, but there's no flag against Derbyshire. It would have counted had he hit the target. Rudolph will have a dig. Almost wrong footed the goalkeeper. Slocum managed to get a strong hand to that, and now the whistle has gone. Just hit from Lee Croft and it was awkward the way it just bounced in front of Slocum. 
Still Oldham doing most of the pressing. What can they do from the free kick here? Slung in towards Simpson, who bundles it in, but he got the goalkeeper first. It's a foul on Sam Slocum, and Robbie Simpson's celebrations are soon cut short. I think it will stay down as well after the collision. Difficult ball to defend. It was flat about two of them, wasn't it? The ball for Simpson to run onto it. And he has Croft arriving in the middle as well in support if he can find him. Oh, he can't. Only a fraction in it, though. Croft just failing to apply the touch, and it stays at 1-1.